Well, we went to the P.O. box and <laughs> Kevin is here. <laughs> um, we received two boxes from Sarah in California. Um, Sarah had hoped that we would receive these uh, like Saturday and then they would have been in uh, last week's vlog instead she's had to wait all this time they ju we just got them today so and we waited Saturday we waited until later to check the PO box and they it, they just weren't there so um, what uh, um. she said she talked it up because because it's she she wrote she said she i went along with my mom nancy to various stores to pick up items that we think we you will love most of the items not all are made in california and we purchased at local stores and market there's so much fun shopping for and selecting items that we think you will thoroughly enjoy wish you a ha very happy healthy and bright holiday seasons uh, on top of shopping for all the various items i also bake you items as well i'm an avid baker and love to bake i thought it would be wonderful to bake items for you I can't wait to see your reaction on film. I made these things that were easy to travel and things that I think you will really enjoy. I have descriptions of everything I made after the description that I obviously purchased. So everything she made, she bought, she has a description, which I think we'll be able to figure those out. Uh, and then I was flipping back to the parts that she actually made. She, um, she's a very good cook. Ashley and I have tried, uh, she sent us cookie last time and she sent us granola. Her granola she sent us some 7-Eleven awesome. stuff. <laughs> well, well she, she asked me, she said, uh, is there any requests that you have from California, from my area? And I said, do you have a 7-Eleven? Because we don't have one of those. And apparently 7-Eleven has their own set of stuff. They have like snacks and all kinds of stuff that we just don't, we don't have a 7-Eleven, so yeah. we don't get to We used to have 7-Elevens around here all, all over the place. But we they, did? Yeah. See, I've never... We were in Lexington, um, matter of fact, the one over what there... What year? The 70s? Oh, way back. Uh, in Wood Hill, uh, there's a gas station when you cross over where Lexington Mall used to be. There's a gas station right there in the corner. They used to be 7-Eleven. Mm -hmm. Anyway, here you go. Back in the old days. It was days. back a long time ago. Back when I was a kid. Okay, so 7 Eleven. Back when the dinosaurs were walking over. Butter toffee caramel popcorn clusters. That will be awesome. Good. Funky chunky peanut chunky butter chunky cup chunky. popcorn and sea salt caramel. I have never heard of these, but boy, do they look good. They look really good. good. Um, and of course, when we do these reviews, we'll tell you where everything is made and all that stuff. Um, cause I'm always curious. Actually, I just peeked. I had to. These are made in Minnesota. I have to peek at stuff. And like, like I said, she's got a full description of everything oh, in here. So. Henry Lambert's Exquisite. It's a premium chocolate. Wow. Oh, and it tells what they're like uh, biscuits, cookies. Um, mm -hmm. With uh, chocolate. Oh, yeah. So, this will be one of those boxes where we try everything in one video. Cranberry shortbread cookies. These are too good gourmet. Oh, here's another one for my company. Mm -hmm. Oh, sea salt cookie. Caramel. Sorry, caramel sea salt cookies. Look how festive that is. That's so pretty. These bite-sized salted caramel cookies will have you coming back for more. These cookies are filled with a burst of gooey caramel goodness and topped off with a pinch of sea salt. They sound wonderful. Okay. Um, I think that was supposed to be on top of the bag. Uh, you it know, came, it, it was. Yeah. It came on Yes, it was supposed to be like this. Well, I tell you what, before I take the picture, I'll take it back on there. Well, I got it to stay. Oh, was it on that one? Yeah, no. it was on that one. I knew there was something, but I... Oh, my s'mores. <laughs> These are the Chihuahua. We've had this uh, brand before with Andrew. Mm -hmm. Yes, you have sent us, but not s'mores. Uh, Sconza, we've had something from Sconza before. Toffee almonds. Here's another one. Look how evil that is. 
Those look so good. These are not by the same company, but toffee, milk chocolate toffee almonds. And these are roasted almonds and rich toffee. She knows I like toffee. I'm a toffee. I never knew growing up that I was a toffee person, and I, I just didn't know that about myself. But I, I am. The chunky bar, right too. Lake Champlain chocolates. This is hazelnut. Milk chocolate crunchy praline and roasted hazelnuts. It's a five star bar. It's also a very thick bar. And I've never heard of that. Oh yeah, you found them all. The complete cookie, Liddy and Larry's. Yes, these are new. Uh, you have double chocolate and lemon poppy seed aha this is the one that everybody's been raving about this is the birthday cake cookie it's supposed to be really good uh, it's supposed to be very very good and these are not um um in our area yet of course so thank you very much because these are expensive okay this is uh what brand is this pete's pete's coffee and tea do you remember yeah. who yeah. We first heard about Pete's mm -hmm. Coffee. Locker Room. Chris oh, Perillo. Oh, really? You watched him, I did. Yeah, Chris Perillo. You yeah, all probably you. have no clue who I'm talking about right now. Chris Perillo, Locker Room, used to talk about Pete's Coffee. We don't have Pete's Coffee around right here. He didn't um, know he was watching. And these are milk chocolate cherries. So those would be awesome. And they're big. Okay. Uh, Joe's. Joe's Peppermint Bar. Trying to see, it's Joe's Candy. These are in California. Okay. Brown and Hallie or Haley. I think it's Hallie. Brown and Hallie chocolate covered gram. And this one is Washington, so close to you. I'm not close sure what to, that is. That, she probably she says. She probably here, says. But um, I don't know. We'll get there. You, the yeah, show. you'll yeah. never. I'll never find it. Just yeah. But they look like uh, uh, chocolate covered something. Truffles or something. Yes, we will. We'll find out what these are. They look really yeah. good. Okay, Sanders chocolates. We have had Sanders chocolates before, but not dark chocolate coconut supreme or maple pecan buttercream. Those both sound really good. <laughs> Andrew, uh, you worked at Liquor Barn for a little while and they had these there, but they didn't have, I don't remember them having these two varieties. Sorry, it's glitter from that star. Oh, okay, God. Lily O'Brien. Okay, Ashley, a couple years ago, Ashley brought home, one of those little, those Ashley brought home a Lily O'Brien chocolate box. Okay, here's another Sanders that Kevin just handed me. Peanut Butter Krispies. Haven't had that one either. Okay, Lily O'Brien Vanilla Truffles. This one looks really good. Yeah, I don't remember much about them. I don't even remember if I was in the video for, or if it was just Aner and Ashley, but I remember that name. So, I don't remember them regardless. Okay, um, Organic Ocho Peppermint. They sell these bars at Meyer, but not Peppermint. We would have never gotten that in our area. Thank you very much. We wouldn't have gotten to try that. Um, I don't know if those are, I'm assuming they're C's, but I don't know that. Um, you think these are C's? I don't know. Uh, they, really? Oh, I don't know. Hold on. Okay, first of all, here. You, these, leave those, these look like bubble guns. Just leave them for a second. Oh. Those are C's oh. mint cream lollipop and cinnamon lollipop. Yes. And sometimes they open a kiosk in the mall, just a little thing out in the middle, and they will give out free um, lollipops. And what kind do you usually get? The caramel lollipop? Caramel. Or, caramel. or butterscotch. Or but and he I loves them. We've never had these two. Christmas mint and cinnamon. Okay, I'm guessing these are the Marich? No, they're not. They're Merrick. Not? They're Merrick? not Merrick. Merrick will be in its own. Because thing. it's talking about crispy mothballs and stuff. Yeah, those are, I, I know those. Those are in their own packages. Why don't you just leave these and keep going? Just leave them to the side and keep going. 
that's not my personality. Kevin has to find. I'll say it. Um, we'll find them in a minute. Those are for Andrew. <laughs> <laughs> they're they really are dog biscuits. Going back, I think it's good dog biscuits. Vanilla dipped dog yeah. bones. She says something about them. I want to hear what she says about them because let me tell you what, if I stuck one of these under Guido's nose right now, <laughs> he would, I don't think he would do anything with it. Do you? Um, no. Uh, he just doesn't know that's kind of funny. He, he yeah, he doesn't. Unless they have, really smell like meat or something, he might. He wouldn't have a clue. And something. they're really, they're hard. Yeah. And he is 11 and a half. And so he can't eat hard things anymore. Yeah, but but we'll try. But we'll even if he try. Doesn't. But Ander has a big dog, and <laughs> yeah, Onyx will love these. If yeah, she Onyx. says our family has two dogs, and we couldn't pass up these gourmet vanilla dip dog bones. Hopefully, Guido will love them. We'll try, we'll but try. I'm just letting you know, probably not. These will probably go to Onyx, but trust me, Onyx will love these. There's glitter all over these. Just. Oh, we don't want to get glitter on the food. Mm -hmm. What is it? These uh -huh. look like uh, um, they look like white uh, chocolate uh, cranberry. Chocolate, cranberry white chocolate toasted coconut oatmeal cookies. Oh gosh! I love oatmeal and I love coconut. Mm, they smell good. They smell so good. But she actually toasted off some coconut. She said so. Wow! Yeah, she she likes to cook. She I like really, to cook too, but I'm just not. And to toast them on coconut. <laughs> I'm way too lazy for that. You're not supposed I'm to sorry I'm peeking. No peeking. Okay, 7 Eleven. This is Steak Lovers Peek Potato no Chips. Steak Lovers Potato Chips. So those will be cool. Honey, mustard, and onion from 7 Eleven. I wonder if Aner would want to try these. You know, it's all about Aner getting a free day, actually. Aner's getting ready to be really busy, so who knows when we'll be able to get him. Now, this looks like my laughing cow. Uh-huh, it does. It's, uh, and it's called Sonoma. It's Sonoma Jacks. It's Sonoma Cheese, Gourmet Cheese Wedges, Garlic, and Herb. And they are... These are only 30 calories, and the Laughing Cow is 35 calories. Oh, there you go. So, we'll be trying those on a Ritz cracker. Uh, Noon's Farms Confections Chocolate Toffee Almonds. I think I love right. the toffee almonds. C's, okay. She also asked me would I like anything else from California, and I said, well, if you don't mind, uh, I don't know how much these cost, but I said, I just love the awesome uh, peanut brittle bar. I, I just love it. They are only 150 calories each, and they, they're just absolutely fantastic. Um, if you've never had them, um, if you can order these online, you need to order them because for 150 calories, you would not believe the flavor you're getting. You're gonna feel like you're gonna feel like you've eaten a full-size candy bar for the flavor you get in one of these. They're awesome, and they will all be mine. <laughs> these see, these are Merrick. These are the Merrick. Is that Merrick as well? Uh, no, I don't recognize that. That's Pete's Coffee. Okay, but so the Merrick, that is Merrick. These two are the other two Merrick then. That is, which Are there no it? more of these in no. there? No, oh. I don't see any, unless it's underneath this other stuff. Oh, okay. it might be right because now, Merrick so. normally comes in a bag just like this. All right, it says those are candy cane caramels. Right, My Merrick candy is... cane caramels. We've had the Merrick brand before. Awesome brand, very, very good. And then the other two Merrick things are chocolate spiced apples and then Christmas malt balls. And okay. I'm assuming this is Christmas malt balls. Okay. And this is probably the apple spice, maybe. Okay. I don't know. Okay, that's fine. I'm just guessing. But, but if you don't see anything, I don't see anything else in here. Then these are the Everything else in here is. Then that's fine. Then they looks like matter. everything else in here is homemade. Yeah. Okay, that's fine. And they look very bottom. These are from Pete's Coffee oh, wait, again. Wait, could be wrong. I told you those couldn't be. So those are the malt balls. So these are Merrick chocolate spiced apples. And the, the, those things, these are all the malted. Well, there was something else she said was dark chocolate. Go ahead and keep reading those. I'll look. Belgian milk chocolate Oreo cookies. 
from Pete's Coffee. Uh, they're only 110 calories for uh, a cookie. I don't think that's bad at all because they're, they're Belgian milk chocolate covered. I, so I don't think that's bad. Is it coppers, dark uh, chocolate covered espresso not, beans? That's, that's I was that. wondering if this was going to be coffee beans. That was my guess. Because it looks like it. That was my guess. It's K-O-P-P-E-R-S. Um, Must be in California. Um, she didn't sign. Yeah. Loves dark chocolate and the, especially to those made got for Andy. Okay, so these are coppers. What are these? Merit. These are merit. Yeah. For sure. That's what it says. Okay. There we go. Christmas malt balls. We got oh. to the bottom of it. <laughs> now we have two uh, 7 Eleven products. We have Crunch Mini Donuts, and they are cake donuts uh, covered in crunchy sweet crumbs. Okay. I thought for uh, for a minute it was going to be a coconut, but it's not. It's just crunchy crumbs. And then we have 7-Eleven blueberry mini muffins. And there's three mini muffins in there. You probably have to dump that out. It's all seeds. Oh, okay. Oh, wow. Good grief. Okay, there's, I'm just going to tell you what's in there and you can pry it out. Okay. The awesome peanut butter bars. Did you already eat that? Get those. Um, eggnog truffle. There's probably one of these. Um, dome shaped and white colored. This is dome shaped and white. So mm -hmm. eggnog truffle. Uh, white mint truffle. They're square shaped. This white. one. These are all from C's candies. Um, and then you have C's mint truffle, which is square shaped and chocolate colored. They're this one. one. And the triangular shaped ones. That's the apple pie truffle, which she we tried that. She said. Be nice to add a few of them in the box. Andrew. Yeah. Andrew loved them. Andrew said when yeah, he opened good. them, he said that those were fantastic. Andrew, he would kiss you if he saw you. <laughs> <laughs> he, he would be very, very happy with these. All right. So now we've got, these are all homemade stuff. Oh, wow. Um, that's probably the peanut butter brownie puppy chow. Oh. Don't. I know. I wanted to eat a cookie immediately. That's no peanut butter. That, that's okay because snack time is in just a little bit, and we'll be doing a review of your all of your homemade stuff in about an hour. You so, have to have okay. So don't worry about nothing's going to sit for long in this house. Oh, wow. That are they cookies? Yes. Um, those are probably the oatmeal peanut butter sandwich cookies. Yeah, are they sandwich oh, yeah cookies? they're sandwiches. Yeah, you can't eat one. If I'm not allowed to eat something, you're not allowed mm. to eat it. Wow. They do smell really they good. Smell, they smell like they have cinnamon in them. Um, mm. Lightly scented cinnamon oatmeal cookie studded, studded with peanut butter chips and white chocolate chips that made the creamy peanut butter filling similar to a Reese's cup. I can't wait. All right, now there's a lot more stuff in here than what you have on the list, so. Oh, really? Yeah. I'm assuming that these are all, so I think she oh. just gave us a bunch of these. Wow. There's like four of these. Oh, brownies. These are. Those are brownies. S'mores truffle brownies. And this oh, is because I actually love wow. And this is more of that. Um, the oh, there's puppy two of them? Yeah. Oh, wow. I don't know what this, Thank you for all the brownies. Oh, this is a purchase. This is a purchase. She gave us six brownies, Kevin, and they're huge. They are big. You know what? We can share these with Andrew and Christina. Yeah. Yeah, and she yeah. said she learned how much Ashley liked them. Yes, so. Ashley loves s'mores. They're yes. huge. They huge. are huge. And I'm not sure what that is. Okay. I have to look. It looks like it's in a bread, I don't know. But. It reminds me of the container that Old Kentucky Chocolates, the fruitcake, came in. So I'm sure it's a specialty uh, chocolate store like that. Um, if I open it up, I'll be able to smell it. If you wait just a second, I'll find it. Did you find Pete's Coffee and Tea Belgian covered, yes. covered Oreos? Yeah. Um, I don't know. Hold on. Is that what cinnamon? Is it a, like a cinnamon coffee cake, maybe? I don't know. I've, I haven't seen it. I'm sure I'm just skipping over it. My guess is it's a cinnamon coffee cake. That's what it looks like. I could be wrong. We got C, 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 C. Are you sure this isn't from C's? No, because we covered all that stuff. Okay. And then we've got candy ink on the. Merrick. Merrick stuff. Then you got the espresso beans, peppermint bark, 
peanut butter crispies. We've done everything on that page. Standard as well, fine. Oracle truffles, uh, Lenny and Larry, Funky Chunky, Sea Salt cookies, shortbread cookies, and on my s'mores, chocolatier. Then all those. Cherries. We've done all that. And this is it. Huh. We'll go over it again later, Dog but it just... looks like a coffee cake. And if it's not on, you know what? Maybe she said there was one thing that she forgot to mention. Well, that was it. I think maybe she told me that. We communicate through Instagram and I haven't been as good on Instagram as I should be, but I'm thinking maybe she told me there was one thing she forgot. This is probably the one thing. So right. did you get it all? That's everything. That's a lot. That's plenty. That's more than enough. Um, uh, we will definitely be trying the homemade goodies first because... And, and uh, she said, by, by the way, she did type the letter this time. Yes. Because so yes. I always think the handwriting looks like typing. Her handwriting, she has beautiful, perfect handwriting, uh, Sarah does. Thank you, Sarah and Nancy. Thank you um, for going together and for picking out all this stuff. Um, the homemade stuff, the big stuff, even the small stuff that, you know, that we can't get around here. We really, really appreciate and it. And her mom, Nancy, said that she won, she wanted to let us know how much she enjoyed watching our videos and, and they had a great time picking things out and I hope you enjoy everything. And she loved the chocolate covered espresso beans we sent. Oh, good. Yeah, remember we went around to mm -hmm. uh, Old Kentucky Chocolate and you Chocolate. went in yeah. Ruth Hunt. Yeah. yeah, Kevin went in uh, Ruth Hunt and bought those with the milk and the dark chocolate. Yeah. So so I'm glad to know that you, you like those. Uh, Sarah had said that you liked the chocolate covered uh, coffee beans. So we were trying to find them anywhere we could. We tried to find them. And we wanted to get some in uh, when we went on our tour in Rebecca Ruth. But they didn't sell them. They, they, they didn't have them. So. No. So thank you very much. And uh, hopefully everyone else that watches this looks forward to all these reviews we're going to do. Today we are going to be opening a box from Berlin. This is, I know I'm going to pronounce your name wrong and I'm sorry. So just know it's A-U-J-A. -A. I would say Aja. That's how I would pronounce that. Probably wrong. There's a card made that says. Um, Kevin did cut the top of the box just to cut your address out uh, because we didn't want anyone uh, to see your address. Um, ah, here we go. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. It's oh yeah. That's thank you for telling me how to pronounce it. Oh yeah. Berlin, Germany. From Berlin, Germany, and I'm not gonna read um, your letter out loud. Uh, but this is a cheat sheet, mm -hmm. so I won't look at this cheat sheet yet because I want to be surprised at what's in the box and I'm going to read your letter later. I try not to read personal, you know, people's personal notes to us on online. I don't want to, or on blogs, I don't want to embarrass anybody. Wonder bar. A wonder bar, yes. Have we, have we had a, we've had a wonder bar, haven't we? I don't know if we've had a wonder bar or not. A magic peanut and caramel cream experience. I don't remember if we've had a Wonder Bar. I know I've heard of them. I'll have to look that up. It's Cadbury, so I just don't remember. Isn't that awful? I know we haven't had this. Uh, Kit Kat Chunky Vanilla Chalk. That will be awesome. And I do love the Kit Kat Chunkies. They are so, so good. They are. What's this? Ah, Milky Way. We love these. We just tried. These are what we have in the candy drawer mm -hmm. right now. We absolutely love these. So thank you. Even if you send us multiples of th things we've already tried, um, we will still eat them. We still eat them. Yeah, they're still, still good. Uh, oh, yes, we love this. This was our uh, one of our very favorite milk bars from Germany, the Oreo. Um, and I've only seen it in the bar form, not in the stick form, but I like it like this because I'm guessing this is more of a single serving, whereas the bars are like two and a half mm -hmm. serving, mm -hmm. serving. So this will be good for one serving. I like it that way. I don't think I've seen the milk bars in a single serving like that. 
Uh, Twix? Is this just a regular Twix? I think it's the Twix. I'd like to see if there's a difference in ours. You, yeah. We will have to, um, we'll have to, I'll have to mark this, put that it's from Germany. It's probably, said it's probably in German. Um, yeah, and. <laughs> You'll be able to figure out because it's in German. We might be doing a comparison. A, a comparison to see if ours is different from that one. That'll be interesting. Ooh, I love ours. those bars. But I've never seen one in a dark package. So Limited edition extra, extra chocolate. Chalk with an extra chocolatey Mars taste. Hmm. Have I ever had a Mars bar? I don't know if you've ever had a Mars bar. They're, a they're light brown over here. They're like a light brown. Is it color. like a uh, Three Musketeers? Um, no, it's more like a Snickers. It's got a nougat and it's got nuts on it. I don't think I've ever had a Mars they're bar. They're really good. So that'll be new to me. Thank you. Reason. Now okay. we get reason over we here, do get but they're reason. in like individual wrapped um, things. So we do get reason here, and uh, so this will be interesting be to see if this is uh, to see if this tastes anything like ours too. Kinder Bueno. Yeah. I think we've had the Kinder Bueno with the hazelnut. We love the Kinder, and it's. Um, the, I think the toys are a lot of fun too. They what are. is this? Choco, Kinder Choco Fresh. We, I'm almost positive I have not seen these. Choco mm -hmm. Fresh. Yeah. That's like mint. Yeah, I've, I haven't seen those. So that'll be fun. You fit a lot into this box. There's more. Oh, <laughs> Ovaltine? Yeah, what if it's orange? I don't know. I'll be looking at your cheat sheet next to see some of these. A Snickers, okay. Snickers is one of my favorite candy bars. But this looks different. Is it the same? Is or is it just the no, packaging? No, it's just the packaging is different. But it may be completely different. Yeah, it, we uh, we won't know until we try it to see if it's different from what we have. A lion. This is amazing. These are awesome. I love these. We have tried the lion before. So 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 good. Um, when Andrew worked at the liquor barn, they had them there. I don't know what that is. It looks like a cake of some kind. It doesn't say. You have to look at the description. I will have to look it up. That, um, the stars remind me of some that Silke sent us from Germany. Uh, some of the packaging. Um, they were like a Santa Claus in town brand or something like that. I'll look at that. Carbo. Fruity. Boosty. I don't know, but I love doing these reviews the because gummies. it gives me an excuse to eat a lot of gummies at one time. I love doing these. And Jenna sent us these little cupcakes and stuff like that. That was so fun to do those because I, oh wow. You really like the next one. I don't know what this is, but so, it has good. green, orange, pink, brown pieces. I don't have Crunchy. a clue. Cracker. Cratcher. Chunky Kit Kat peanut butter. And we have had these before, right? Um, I think so. They're really good. I think the Kit Kat crunchy peanut butter that we had, I'm thinking one side was creamy and one side was crunchy maybe. Yeah, I'm just gonna hand you the, this is it. This is the last stack. Okay. Oh, wow. Good grief. Candy bars. Okay, this reminds me very much of the um, the Cadbury, the uh, the Ritz. They have they had the Tuck one too, remember? Yeah. We, too, we didn't know if it was Tuck or Tuck or whatever. Yes. They're like a biscuit. And this is a college, is how we would pronounce that. A they collage. Maybe they are saying collage. Mm. It looks good. And then this, is that a, like a yogurt, yogurt a yogurt maybe? And then just an Alp, Alp, Alpen cream. And then the Dane. And I don't think we've, I don't know that we've had any of those. So that'll be fun to do. Mm. This is one of the traditional German gingerbread. Made with hazelnuts. I bet you that's the, um, that. 
Oh, this. It's good, I think so. Do they write a number on there? No. No. Put a number on the piece of paper, that's what I was wondering. Sometimes uh, somebody has put a number on the package to match with their uh, what they wrote on the paper, which I thought was really cool. Uh, what do you want to know about the oval or whatever? Yeah. Um, this bar is from Switzerland. Yeah, and it actually it, they have a powder. I don't know why I said it like that. It's from Switzerland. I don't know why I said it like that. Switzerland. I'm reading so. The hair bows are fruit flavored gummies with fruity filling. The other ones are chewy candies with a sherbet filling. Ah, okay. And then, um, which one else did you Milka. Want? Yeah. Um, Chocolate with yogurt is with one of them. Yeah, one of the collage or collage, I think it's collage. Collage. Uh, chocolate cream, raspberry, caramelized hazelnut, and chocolate chips. Uh, the Dane bar is uh, originally from Sweden. Crunchy almond butter bar pieces. They exist as a chocolate bar in cakes and other products of this brand. The Dane candy is originally from Sweden. Well, cool. We will keep this, your cheat sheet, with us. I, anything that we have not tried, we'll definitely do a review on. Like I said, we I know we've tried the Milky Way, and I know we've tried the Oreo. Um, so anything, maybe the Quick Kinder Bueno too, but anything that we have not tried, um, I will definitely do a review of it. Yeah, and we may have to do some blind taste tests from like the Snickers and the Twix and the Reason. Um, to see how they compare to the ones. Yeah, here. that'll be that'll be really really fun because sometimes I know like the Oreos in Canada, the Completely Oreos different. they they were different in Canada than they were here. So it, it was really fun to to find that out. So thank you very very much. I'm glad I got it in time for Christmas because you wrote on the box that it was candy for Christmas. So uh, tomorrow is Christmas Day, so we got it in time. So thank you very very much. Uh, I Should I pick her up by, with the blanket oh, over there? Since she's warm in here, it's snuggly. <laughs> I think her hair is darker. Look at that chin. I thought she, she had have more. She has the chin. Oh, you put the shelf together. Huh? We did that before she got here, though. <laughs> Kevin, okay. bring it over here. She has the ah. Smith. That's your maiden name. Oh, you're talking about my mom. Like, she, yeah. she, your family. She has your family's chin. Yes. And you'll die. Um, I think she looks like a girl version of Gavin. I told you. Oh, you got 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 I told you it was the softest thing you ever felt in your life. Oh, look at her. She's like, who is this corpse touching me? Look at that one. Right now. Christina, her fingers are so I long. Look how long her fingers are. Hey, watch that. She's beautiful. And he totally did that on purpose. He looked at me like. Watch out the water bottle. Yeah, there's a water bottle. Careful, don't knock your head. What's with this extra little chin down here? I know, I love it. I love the chin. Oh, you should see her arms. Feel her hair. Feel her hair, Daddy. Oh, she's got the little chin on her head. It's um, it's definitely not red hair. I know. I don't know when it, it might get red. Yeah, we'll see. It aren't her fingers long, Kevin? Her little feet are the cutest. You gotta go potty. Okay, let's go potty. Will you hold this? You want me to take her? You want mo mommy? Doesn't want to have to get up. Here, let mommy rest. Come here. You want to go with Nana? Go with Nana. Come with me. Play it everything. Just don't drop it, like that one guy did. Oh, big boy. This is not a good angle. Ashley insisted we get her undressed because she had to show her feet. Look at how cute. They're teeny tiny little feet, but I'm taking pictures too, so I'm going to insert some pictures at the end of this video, but um, she's just beautiful, and I said that about her chin because um, 
Christina, their their family just has, the, I think it's just the cutest, sweetest little chin. And Gavin has this little chin, and now she does. And she's beautiful. She's very, very, very soft. Oh, look. Look at her leg rolls. But I don't think she appreciates being uncovered oh like this. But I, I always forget with newborns about the umbilical cord. Christina, how long did they say it would be before that? Gavin's is about two weeks. Two weeks? Okay. Or like a week to two weeks. Do you have to put stuff on it? Yeah. No. And you, but you have to wait for a while before you can give them a bath. I thought with, with Ashley, we would put, they told us to put rubbing alcohol on it, it would dry it out or something. Oh my gosh, let's not play that game. <laughs> no, I'm thinking, I'm almost positive they told remember. us to. Look. I've heard of that though. Molly, like, quick, take pictures. Look at her little baby toe. Or, or maybe it wasn't rubbing out, but it was something they gave us that you put it around to dry it out. You see that? Her baby toe. It sm like maybe that's what it was, it smelled like rubbing alcohol. Take a picture of them. I will take a picture of them. Oh, they're up right now. Yeah. Oh, I didn't show that. This is the shelving unit that we got Christina for Christmas. And with all the uh, uh, storage bins. Christina, do you have toys in there? Or, or? She's yelling at you. Put it up like a baby. So a lot of them are empty. Empty. Our eyes are opening slightly. Are you singing? Are you going to open your eyes? Hmm. Amelia. Are you going to open oh, it? Oh, I forgot. Eyes? I didn't go to the, there's festive no. masks. That's the last thing I need to do. She said, I'm just exhausted. <laughs> See, I'm just exhausted. Ashley was in the bedroom talking to Kevin about the cat like and I thought she's talking about that cat like it was a baby She said he went right upstairs and laid down and went to sleep and went to sleep and I thought she's talking about that cat like a baby Mommy do you see the face? Oh I know I wish she would wake up I'm trying to force you to make it. Lay her right here. Like, put her on your, put her on her tummy, like right here. And sometimes she'll look up at you. Or cuddle. Or cuddle. What's up, white box? What? Are you going to look at me? I would like that. <laughs> What? The white one's for carrying Karuma. The death of all players. Look, she's smiling. But now with this her. is Arby. Amelia. Yeah. The festive masks they have. Did that charger work? Yeah. It's, it's green. That means that's ready to go. I love it. That's like the best Christmas present for him. Well, I'm, you know, I knew he was going to battle with Arby. Um, probably like the Duracell batteries, like the four packs, maybe a week or something like that. So that you can just get that and charge it up and then you want to switch, you just switch the battery packs out. Do you want to get back on though? Ashley's going to take her bow off. Oh, there is like a line. I had it on her for pictures anyway. Amelia in England, um, they... Keep, kept bows on her all the time. Look. Once she gets a little bit older yeah, and her head's not forming as much, I just don't want her to have like a dent. Yeah. A dent. What does Onyx think? Has Onyx been around her? He hasn't been around her? Yes, he was outside. Oh, we're trying him. Oh, he looks. Do you see him out there? I plan on doing that late tonight. He's wet. Yeah. So. But they kept bows on her all the time, and now that her hair's growing out a little bit, they've kept them off. But they did keep bows on her. Uh, yeah. My battery light's blinking. It's okay. All right. Okay, these, uh, this is where Andrew put his stocking stuffers, his little inside out figures. And then these are those Minecraft, um, those Minecraft cubes that he got. He's already put all three of them together. And I don't remember what they were called. Um, but yeah, he's put all three of them together. And this is the one, I think this is the end. I'm not sure what these were called. 
Um, that's the one with the dragon on the top. And then there's the one with the pig and the little man. I have no idea what he's called. Uh, but anyway, Andrew's already put those together. I'm shocked. She's only done that once so far. Well, I put her up here and she immediately went burp. That's when I said, you can burp, no throwing up. No puking allowed. By the way, your pants are good. I saw all their Christmas uh, gifts and everything. Oh, and yeah. I love the week pad. Yeah. Oh, from Gav for uh, Gavin. It's simple enough to where he could do it in the back seat of the car. Or mm -hmm. Oh yeah. Just make noises and. Yeah. Hey, Gavin. Andrew looked at one of those things that I don't even know what that is, and I'm an adult. <laughs> what is it? Oh, on there. No, on that leap pad. There was something you're supposed to solve, picture what it is, and he said, I don't even know what it was. Her shirt says something on the back. What does it Let's say? It says, let's see. It says, oh. protect, nurture, love. It's a hippie thing. A hippie thing? I guess. Should that surprise me? <laughs> this is how Ashley almost all of them. Uh, with their legs up. Ashley lived on his chest just like that at all times. With the legs up. Just like we this. held oh Ashley, God. even though we had Aner, we played with Aner, played games, everything. But we held Ashley all the time. I want to get a Moby wrap so that I have my hands free and she's just right here. Mm. That's a good idea. I love Moby wraps. But I have, here, let me show you because I don't even know what it's called. It's like it's plain. Yeah, you you had something with Gavin, didn't you? Yeah, and it works, but like they're kind of loose and I'm afraid that I'll hit his head or hit her head. Gavin, where's your ship? You like your ship, your boat? It's up there. Your pirate boat. Pirate ship. That's it. Yeah. It didn't stay open very long. That's it. It's this. I guess it's just the same. It's not as good as the Oh, yeah. It's like their heads way down here, and it, like if you're doing dishes or something, it can bump on the sink right. and stuff. Would that be good for going? Like, like this. Yeah. It's like a rabbit. You just tie it around. Okay. Ooh, you got your pirate ship. Okay. Okay. I stole it. I stole it. Okay. I stole it. I stole it. <laughs> that is funny. The pirate ship. It's funny. Funny. Is funny. that your favorite toy from Christmas? It was amazing how he opened the box and immediately pulled that out. I mean, he okay. knew what that was. She's hungry and she's getting ready to eat. <laughs> Mama's gonna feed her. Mama's using the new sheets that we gave them for Christmas. They love them. This is the fire that we bought um, Gavin from Amazon. And they had to charge it and Andrew had to set up the... Um, the account and all that with the uh, Amazon passwords. And so now he's playing, what is he playing? It's a kind of preschool game. A preschool game. Oh, he's making the bird. There you the go. Good chick. job. Why is the preschooler playing the preschooler game? He is playing it. Oh, I thought you were playing it. No, he, no. no. <laughs> <laughs> she thought you were playing it, Andrew. <laughs> no, Gavin's playing it. And he's doing a good job. good job. He just put together a puzzle. Oh, I want to go on again. You want to do it yeah, again? Yeah. Oh, goat. See, those are legs. There you good job. I got the feet. I got the feet. I think that one goes up there. Oh, it goes right here. Right, it's yep. You almost had it like right there. Neck. I'm terrified. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Oh, there you go. And that's the bot. That's the chest. That's a harder one. It goes over here. It goes right there. Oh, right there. Good job. That's its tail. Oh, I cannot wait to start. It's its blood. If he throws in the bathtub, it's covered. It. Yeah. For two years. It's of course, he shouldn't do kids. that. Do you like that, Gavin? You like it? You can watch Mickey Mouse on there or anything. <laughs>